What's up guys, it's Robo13. I have a really quick uh, untethered jailbreak for you guys. The first thing you need to do is jailbreak your device using uh, Red Snow. And the newest one I think is Red Snow uh, 9 0.9.10 beta 1. Uh, I'll have links in the description for you guys to get that. You want to just jailbreak that uh, using your 5.0.1 firmware, not the 5.0 firmware anymore. Now you can use the 5.0.1 firmware. And just to show you guys that I am on 5.0.1. I will go into general and about and right there 5.0.1 okay then after you get Cydia and you're on the tethered jailbreak you're gonna go into Cydia you want to make sure that you use the newest red snow though because that will uh, let you install the Cydia Cydia store installer packages and then that's what you need to get uh, this untethered jailbreak so then after you get the tether jailbreak, go into Cydia, come up to search, type in C-O-R-O-N-A, Corona, hit search, and then you're going to scroll down and see Corona 5.0.1 untether. This is a real jailbreak. This is from the uh, Chronic Dev team, as you can, when I click on it, you can see Chronic Dev team right there. So once you install this, this will install all the untethered files that you need in order to turn your device on and off using the 5.0.1 you'll just run it just like this it'll say installed and then return to Cydia and you're good to go so now I'll show you guys that I can turn this off Alright, it's completely off, and I'm going to boot it right back up. And then I'll even go into Cydia. So if this is a little shaky, if it's uh, out of focus every now and then, I'm using my uh, Logitech webcam, as you can see right there in the reflection. So once this boots back up, I'll then go into Cydia and show you guys that the untethered jailbreak is complete and this is for 5.0.1 this is for the uh every device that has the a4 chip so that means uh the ipod touch 4g the ipod or the uh ipod touch 4g the iphone 4 and the uh, ipad 1 but not the ipad 2 or the iphone 4s um so for any device that can run ios 5.0.1 will work um except for the ipad 2 or the iphone 4s so see it booted right back up. I'm gonna go over here and click on Cydia. And Cydia opens up just like that. So hold on one second. So as you guys can tell, this is the tether jailbreak and it just booted right back up and went right back into Cydia and I can even go to the home page everything and it works everything works so it all it all comes back on you don't have to worry about it uh you don't have to worry about plugging it back into red snow and turning it on and uh using just boot tether right now just use this and this will untether jailbreak your device so hope you guys like this video and i will see you guys on friday thanks guys